Put a shirt on. <laughs> Wait, sushi right, with no there. shirt. Don't don't right, don't. Put, shirt that's on. a tongue twister. Sushi with no shirt. Sushi with don't. no shirt. Sushi. With no shirt. <laughs> 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 I was like, hold up. <laughs> also, that sounds. Also, for some other reason, that sounds like it would be unreasonably, unreasonably messy. I don't know why. I'm using the soy sauce. That's why it would seem like it'd be unnecessarily messy. Hold up, why? Why are you all in this man's sushi though? Let him eat in peace. <laughs> Wait, what kind of sushi are we talking? Are we talking like? God damn, Basil. We talking like maki rolls. We talking like nigiri. We talking. Both. The Maki. He said both. <laughs> he said both. All up in this man's sushi. Jeez. Both. Well, look, I haven't had Japanese in a long while, okay? I'm I'm, I'm kind of jonesing for it. Where'd you get the sushi from? In yours. Okay, okay. As long as he didn't say the gas station, because that would have been bad. <laughs> no, I, I never order sushi from the gas station. No matter how bad I want sushi. They had the guy with the little hat in the back of the gas station. <laughs> <laughs> you want some sushi next to the powdered donuts? Be like, nah, you nah, was... fam, I'm, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> so I also learned don't... don't ever get the sushi from campus either. See, I never had problems with that sushi. You never had. I, mean, I didn't either until the one time. The last time I got it, it was, it was violent. Violent, like bathroom wise, or mm-hmm. okay, I hear. Mm-hmm. yeah, mm. we're gonna leave it at that. Is that, that that's where that. that 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 goes there, and that's it, man. <laughs> yeah, speaking of that's it, welcome back to the Crisscross Corner podcast. I'm your host, Chris Canty. We're back with the great debaters. We got David Norday, we got Basil Lowe, and we have the incredible, the great historian, Walter Wheat Wheatstins. <laughs> You've been making that joke for a decade now, and I want to <laughs> hit you every time you say it. <laughs> every time I said wheat is, I, ste- I stepped away a little bit, so you wouldn't <laughs> be able to kick me. So we're about to talk about something that happened over last weekend. Yeah, and it makes it even worse. <laughs> Hold up, what happened last weekend? Everybody knows what happened last weekend. Let's get right into it. What you doing, That's- Detroit? What you doing, Detroit? Now, the Detroit, the Detroit Rams have won the <laughs> oh, Super that's Bowl. What happened. Yep. <sighs> Let me just tell you, I'm so proud of Matthew Stafford finally leaving Detroit and getting what he deserves, a Super Bowl championship. So for any, so any, any NFL players or potential NFL players listening to this right now, the trick is don't go to Detroit. No, 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 no. That's not what the trick is. The, the trick, trick is, the- is come to Detroit, <laughs> develop hatred for Detroit, leave Detroit, and you'll be a champion. That's right. Mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Every Yo. time. Yo, Any sport. Y'all are, y'all are tripping. It never it's like fails. like the Sith round, okay. It's like being a Sith. What? What the hell? You, you, you come to Detroit oh, not to win, but for the experience. That's what you got to get in your mind. It never fails, David. It never fails. <laughs> okay. okay. But I'm proud we'll of tell you, We'll teach you how to play the sport. You just got to learn. You just got to learn. That's it. You just got to <laughs> want to learn. <laughs> want to learn for 12 years? <laughs> want to learn. You don't get there eventually. You will, 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 yeah. Just not with us. <laughs> Damn, with us. Dang, dang, David. I'm about to say, wait, wait, you're gonna get the wait with De- with Detroit, the Lions. It's Never. look, look, all all, all jokes aside, I was I was really happy to to see somebody who I watched growing up in Detroit make the Super Bowl. Film. I didn't and, realize it was a lot of first timers. Hmm. A lot of what them. really cracks me or what really got me though was the fact that this was probably the most um was the most Hollywood thing I think I've seen in a long time. Like it was, yes. I was most like, definitely. Oh. And it's only fitting this in LA too. I was it looked like, like, oh. it, looked like, it looked like a Lakers game. Man. Not only, not only that, but it was also, you know, they had, um, you know, they, they did lift every voice and sing, which I really liked. I like. I haven't seen Mary Mary in a while. Um, I forgot Mary Mary was I, a thing. Yep. 
And then they and then they were like America. They were like here to sing America the Beautiful. And I echo and I was like, didn't she do that one song and or that one line in that one song about the the groceries and yeah she yeah. did yeah yep. yep. and I'm, right. like the the only thing I thought about that was get you a person who can do both right like <laughs> God dang Walter that was he was thinking during the coin toss. <laughs> He was like, "Yeah, I wanted today." I go, "No, no, 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 no." That was no. Ed, I wasn't thinking. No, that wasn't what I was thinking. But I like for a second, I was sitting there like, "Man, they they really they really are putting on a, a get you a person that can do both." But I liked it. It was definitely a like uh, as it was explained uh, the entire way through was like a Hollywood like it was it was very Hollywood. It was very show. The game itself was too like coming down to the last two minutes like that. I lost my mind. That game on that was, last touchdown that game was lit. I was gonna be mad. At Stafford, if he would have lost, I promise you, I would have. I'm like, all the stars are aligning. This is what your destiny is. <laughs> Had you would have lost, fam. Not only did you have the better record out of both of y'all, but you made it. <laughs> you made it. You made it here, and now you're gonna choke with two minutes left. <laughs> hey, look, but I mean, but like they had some, they had some injuries on both sides for a minute there. I was like, I'm oh, not, I'm not gonna lie. That flag saved Seth Stafford's career. <laughs> that flag in the end zone <laughs> saved Stafford's career. It did. It really did. No, if you want, no, if you want to talk about choking, I feel like the the one that everyone's talking about the most right now is Eli Apple. Yeah, but he's why he's, is that? He's used to it though. Okay, but <laughs> let's see. I think the last play he got choked, like not choked, but like he got smoked on. <laughs> like he was gone on me. He didn't know what was going on. <laughs> I was like, oh, oh, oh shit. <laughs> no. You want to know who got exposed on Super Bowl Sunday? It wasn't Eli Apple. It was Jalen Ramsey. Did you see how yeah. many times that nigga fell trying to get my man? <laughs> he was like, what did he get? Oh, shit. Hey, look, <laughs> it, it, it happens. <laughs> It happened, yeah, it happened like three times the whole Super Bowl. I was like, Jalen, just get oh. up. Now, we know of someone who doesn't think that Mexico is in Latin America. Segway, huge, huge segue back to what we're, the other thing we we're talking we'll, about. We'll get into that later. Podcast. We're going to talk about a few states in America that people have, you know, you know, they think it's part of this region. They think it's part of that region. So one of the first states that comes to mind when talking about is this state in the South, East, West, Midwest, the first one that comes to mind is Kentucky. Is that the Midwest or is it yeah, down no. South? Is it's that Midwest. Considered, what is it considered? It, it is, I would say, part of the Midwest. old South, like Virginia and stuff like that. That's why I would consider South. I would. Virginia is considered the East Coast, apparently. Wait, hold up. Pause, pause. Could could. I we'll want to hear the there. answer from the geography people. So, to me, oh. Kentucky, when I think of t- Kentucky, I don't think down south, but I don't think Midwest either. That's the no. problem. It's, a, it's that, just there. No, it's the just problem, there, though. right. It's Thank like, you, Chris. It's, no. it's, like, it's, like, it's like temperance Ohio. It's like, it's not, it's, it's, like, it's like right there at the border, and it's like right there at the Ohio. It's like there. Mm-hmm. So Wait, like temperance Ohio? Yes. <laughs> yes. It's just there, Basil. Just accept it. It's just there. Just accept it, Basil. <laughs> yes, I said it. <laughs> yes, I did. Well, I, I hope that's just a joke and you hold on. Oh, no, that, that so, joke. That's just like that where I joke? found out when, when you had told us that you're like right at the border of Ohio and Michigan. I'm like, what? Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm right. I sit on the border. It's temperance, man. That's, that's Wait, are you in temperance that's, or Sylvania? You're just there. It's not like you're in. You're I, you're just technically, there. by technically by zip code, I'm in Erie. So my Erie, so exactly. Erie, Michigan, Erie, Michigan. If you have to go by mailing zip code, yeah. Interesting. So you're just there. You're just there. So 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 Kentucky. <laughs> now, for for me, how just, I would go by yeah. is so you have the Deep South, which is like. Mississippi, mm-hmm. Alabama, mm-hmm. Louisiana. Uh-huh. Then you have your old South, which would be like Tennessee, Virginia, North Carolina. Okay, Tennessee me, is definitely Tennessee's definitely that's, South. That's South. definitely South. But going going back, going to my point now, though, anything south of the Ohio River, 
okay. is part of the the top the, the top half of the South. Wait, do we not go off of the Mason Dixon line anymore, or is that too? I used too old? to. I mean, I could, but people like to go by like what Basil said, the Ohio River, and you like yeah. to take the Mason Dixon line. So because they're Ohio. technically, so technically, Kentucky's in the middle. It is. I, would, yeah. I, I don't know. I always thought of Kentucky as like like Kentucky and sort of. Tennessee as well, and sort of, sort of the states in that band across the country. And we just like half and half. But like, like the mid region. So mm-hmm. I, I like, I, yeah, you could call it Midwest. You can call it the South. You can call it the Mid South. Call it a day. Well, you can't call it Midwest. What do people from Kentucky call themselves? Just uh, uh, at me on Instagram and Facebook, please. <laughs> I, I, I've been, I've been in Kentucky a few times. I love I like I like going out of Louisville. I like it. But I don't know what they call it. We got we got the Michiganders, obviously Michigan, Hoosiers in Indiana, Ohio. The damn Buckeye. But yeah, people. it's Kentuckians. Oh. What about Virginia? Is that considered South or is it considered East Coast? It is South. That's that's the, the old South. Know from Virginia say it's, it's, it's the South. considered East Coast. It is no, technically. It well by that definition, so is Maine, so is Rhode Island. I mean, yeah, they, Look, they are, they're all are East, East Coast. That's, they're called East Coast. That's New England, though. No, no, so I, was always told, I was always told the like the original 13, like New England or the like the, the colonies make up the East Coast. Yeah, yeah. they do. And, and if you're going to go, and, go by that. And then, you have but, to... but also the East Coast is broken up. Yeah. It's on because the south, you're the Northeast. Mid-Atlantic, Northeast. Mid-Atlantic yeah. and the Southeast. Yeah. And everybody that I know that's from Virginia calls it the South. Mm-hmm. It's because it is mm-hmm. because hey. oh 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 Maryland because Maryland and Delaware Virginia. would usually be included with Pennsylvania, New Jersey with the mid right the mid and interestingly enough I I don't know I feel like it's it's one of those things where and I mean I could be wrong about this um and forgive me Virginians if I'm wrong um but it seems like that's sort of similar to how people from the suburbs will say they're from like the major city. Mm-hmm. Be like, Pat, be like, oh, thank you, you. <laughs> thank you, Walter, thank you, Walter. Like, like I, and, and, and I, I don't mean that in any bad way. I know, I, I know, I don't usually be like the, the guy who causes some controversy on this show, but I, I, I don't Just mean say that it like it that. is, say it like it is, Walter. Just say it like it is, you mean it. Look, I'm trying not to get canceled, okay? I do, um, look, I do hey. believe, I do it's believe that, happened. I do believe yeah. that, um, Virginia is, t- I would, my thing for the South is if you're. If like uh, Walter said, Mason Dixon line South, I would say it's the South, like pure South, like it's, they have the accent, is, yeah. the oh, oh, accent, oh, oh, but, similar, but similar, and everything. To what, but similar to what Basil said, um, the South is also broken up. Right? Yeah, the old South and the deep South. You got the deep South, which I guess technically by latitudinal location you could throw Florida in. I wouldn't throw Florida in with the deep South, but you could. Well, no, technically um, it is. No. I- Florida is definitely the oh, South. Oh, Florida, is, yeah. Florida, least, Florida, Florida, is Florida, or at least the Panhandle is definitely deep South. Yeah, no, yeah, the Panhandle been... is definitely South. <laughs> we don't claim the Panhandle. <laughs> okay, Florida, we'll been, no, like, would you would you call like Miami the deep South? Yeah, no, because no. essentially, here, here, no, all right, here, Basil, no, all right, Basil, here, here we go. Here we, Basil's fired. Um, Basil's fired. He just called Miami. Oh, the deep here's, south. here's the best I've, way to I've put done it. it again. I have if done it's from it again, Virginia, I'm very happy with to it. Georgia. Remember how we were just talking about how the colonies and all that? Georgia. Those. That's the old. That's the old South. Anything that wasn't included in that is the new South, the deep South. So unfortunately, that is going to have to include Florida. But who now, cares? But who cares? <laughs> I mean, granted, it, Florida is at least the only deep south place I'd ever go to. But it's south, but we we call it like Florida. You know what I'm saying? Florida is Florida. It has a, it's so, different know, than would... Georgia and, and Alabama. What would we consider West Virginia? I was just about to ask. I was about to that. ask that. that was the next state on the list. God damn it, it, Basil. It, hey, 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 I got one. It's just there. <laughs> <laughs> it's what? <laughs> It's, it's just there. fucking there. Well, no, and, but that, I, I thought about that too. I was like, where would West Virginia be? Because you, it I wouldn't there. exactly call West Virginia East Coast. I wouldn't call it the Midwest. I mean, you can call it Appalachia, but that's what it other states there. would you consider? What? Well, it's Appalachia there. would then you'd have to it include the, the, the Appalachian Appalachian mountains, mountains, and all the, mountain, the mountain range. They do. Like, the mountain I, range. As, far, oh. as far as I know, West Virginia is the only state that anybody has ever classified as like an Appalachian mountain state. 
Yes, it's that's without, like, that's all it is. without without it being classified in another region of the country. That's because really that as what? someone that definitely drove through it within the last year, it's Ooh, definitely that's good. all it is. It's just mountains. And, that, I, and that's I'd fine. Say, I, I, I'd say Midwest. I'd say Midwest. Schools definitely feel me. I didn't know that's how you pronounce it. That's and that's coming from a deep part of my heart. Like, this, I'd say it's Midwest. I've lost friends over this one. Oh, boy. Ohio. No. People say. Uh-oh. Okay. People, that's because I don't want to mention their name because they're no longer my friend. People say. Well, that is. That exposed them. People say that Missouri. Okay. Okay. And this this makes my skin crawl to the point where I don't want to talk anybody. Oh, now they said that Missouri, the state of Missouri, is part of the South. I I do agree that it is. I, like, I, I don't. Missouri. Both of y'all hands went up. I was well, like, oh, yeah. because like, because I again I got friend I got friends in Missouri that will call it the South every day of the week. However, it is still classified as a Midwestern state. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Midwest, Midwest states, me. St. Louis, 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 Kansas City. Like, come on now. I got a question. Why the why is there such thing as a Midwest when we're close to the East? Because at the time when they when they like did the regions, we hadn't. As far as I know, we hadn't pushed all the it, it's look man i don't we're have not even now, in the middle it's, towards it's, the west now pennsylvania okay what or you said pennsylvania mid-atlantic boom oh. no one says mid-atlantic is it an east coast or is it midwest it's Why a mid-atlantic state east. Don't, yeah. we're up, east. East. don't upset hershey i'm not upset to hershey i'm just saying people no, say it, who, it depends on where you are in pennsylvania too because you're from West Pennsylvania, you think you're in the Midwest. If you're in Philadelphia, yeah. you think you're East Coast, which they are East Coast. Yeah, exactly. So, but, so but the state what? as a whole, so it's, it's fair enough, it's fair it's enough to East say Coast. that, like the Mid Atlantic, for for most for most intents and purposes, Mid Atlantic, I would count as for the most part the East Coast. For a regular person who doesn't even oh. know the division of the state, fine, for, thirteen for, for colonies. Right. For, for a regular person, person in America, <laughs> you see Chris, stupid people. How do you not know the 13 Chris, colonies? Trust Chris, me, there are a lot of people who don't. Listen, I can only name five. I'm going to keep it being. Pause, pause the <laughs> show. What's five? This show has been brought to you by Anchor. Follow and subscribe to the podcast on Anchor, the Crisscross Cross Corner podcast. Listen for free or go to Anchor. Dot fm slash crisscross corner slash support donate five dollars a month ten dollars a month even a dollar a month to sustain future episodes thank you for your support again that's anchor.fm slash crisscross corner slash support now let's get back to the show <laughs> Welcome back to the Criss Cross Corner Podcast. I'm here with David Norday and the Great Debaters. He told us he only knows five of the 13 colonies. Now, David, just for your reference, Michigan is not one of the 13 No, colonies. Michigan is not one. I know. I know. <laughs> so what Philly what, what five one. do you know? Wait, wait. What was one? Philly. Oh, okay. All right, y'all. Wait, it's going to really? be, be a short episode today. We're gonna, no, no. We're going to count it. Keep moving. No, no. Philly? Okay, Philly. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania is one. Yeah. Pennsylvania. Then you have um, Massachusetts. Basil. Basil. Okay. Basil took his glasses off. Okay. Massachusetts. <laughs> oh All right. We're at a good start. I'm not sure if Virginia is one, but I'm just going to say it's an effort. Okay. Yeah, okay. That's, that's three. One. Okay. That's three. He might know six. I know six. <laughs> I'll keep it a bean with you. I can't get past that. <laughs> Wait, you forgot as about much, his, all listen, these big states on the East Coast? Was my worst, worst, worst subject in school. But, but it's stuff that happened, though. Actually, that's more right. It doesn't than matter. I don't know the history of it like that because I don't want to study it. But but you forgot about New York, New Jersey. Right. You, Connecticut. Georgia. 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 South Carolina, North Carolina. Carolina. You see what I'm saying? You, you see what I'm saying? 
Maryland. Delaware. Maryland. I forgot Maryland was the state. Connecticut. Thank Rhode Island. Thank you, Thank you Chris. Thank you. See? I got New Hampshire. Vermont. Boom. See? I knew Vermont was one. Why did I know that? Because I got a quarter collected. <laughs> Good God. Oh, you, got a, you knew that it was a steak because you got a quarter. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I looked at my phone for a second. Did he really just say, I want to go home? I want to go home. Okay. It's been a long day. Sir, this is your home now. It's been a long Next, day. like hour and a half. This is where you live. It's been a long day, y'all. Base is over there trying to not blow up like a strawberry right now. Look at his face. <laughs> oh, my God. He is red. Oh, my We're God. back on the show. We're back on the show with Walter, Chris, oh. and Bezo and David. Yo, Bezo can't believe. That I, you know what? Should I win a lottery? That commercial break, man. If I if I win Mega Millions, I am personally going oh. to kick out the Detroit Public Schools superintendent. Mm-hmm. I'm going to become the superintendent and put all of my money into the school district because that of is a, this. Look, man, well, that, that, that is now. that. First of all, that is a very great uh, philanthropic thing to do. However, Basil, you will be on Watch Bojo as the top 10 at dumbest Woo! wall lottery winners in history. Just tell so, I will I will fix this. No, 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 no. <laughs> yes, Chris, hey, Chris, hold on, hold on, hold on, Chris. Yes, I that's got, a word. Okay, I got an explanation though. Why you gotta throw Watch Mojo into it like that, man? That's so unnecessary. <laughs> Number one, Basil yeah, Mojo never, the thing. <laughs> I always travel from school to school. So most of the stuff was like either repeated, but you didn't, but you didn't put it, keep it there. You didn't keep it there. Yeah. No, the, it was so, already the, repeated. The, look, I'm like, I already look, learned this. Why well, I gotta learn it again? Look, we can go into the problems with the educational system a different day. My girlfriend wants to be yeah. a teacher, and a lot of the stuff that they go through is just. Oh, she do. I'm and just... it's and it's it's one of those things where you you sit there and go like at some point in time like. You can't fault a child for not learning, right? Because the teacher's job is to learn or is to teach, right? Like, in that that that's important. A child needs to learn something too, and that's also important. But if we're not teaching the right things, or we have disengaged students, and that's an issue. And a lot of the times, it's not that the students aren't learning; it's just that they're disengaged. Um, this is one of the biggest things that we tackled in a lot of the, in one of the history classes that I was, uh, that I helped teach a few years back. And we solved that by making it a game. Right. So we, we ran into, hold on a second. Let me, let me grab it. Hey, 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 Walter, Walter quit. Oh, what? I'm going to need you to speed your answers up. This is a 30 minute show. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got it. I got it. So, so. Oh, no, no, oh, no, you didn't. (laughs) No, you didn't. He ruled it. It's fine. He, we got we got time. We got to put in put in ads, commercials. Come on now. Oh, uh, no. But we we came across it. like these game books, um, which have been really helpful to teach it because it's it it throws the student in that situation, right? So all of a sudden you're like, hey, look, we like Caesar just got killed. What do we do with his body? How do we lead Rome? There's like somebody marching, like people are marching on a door, and it it makes the students go. It makes them actually sit there and engaged because they have to because now they're in the situation where hey it's so it's role playing it's all this other stuff i recommend it if regular learning isn't your kind of thing and it seems like now especially nowadays the, like the attention span is shorter and that's a proven fact so maybe we look into alternative ways to teach students to keep them more engaged the more engaged they are the more they'll retain the higher our scores will be not only that but the smarter our kids will be and that's the most important thing and uh um, hey, the, hey, actually hey. the one thing that watcher that was really good. Um, it was. What I did in high school is for uh, World War, War for World War Two, we turned it into we turned the whole like World War Two like timeline into a Jerry Springer episode. And let me tell you, I learned everything I needed to know about World that, War Two. Oh my god! That, in is, three so that is three weeks. That is three weeks. That is no. That is like seriously genius. That, that is. Was, that great. is. I'd watch I that. would like to see that. That's basically all it was. It was basically hey, a Jerry Springer show, aka the teacher store right there off of um off of Middle Bell and Lavoie. They need to be taking some notes. Hey, you don't the teacher okay, store. All right, all right, y'all. Let's let's take a break right now and talk about the teacher store on Six Mile with Middle Bell. I don't even know if it's still open. I don't think oh, it, it is. is. It, it is? is. 
the teacher's store. It's permanently closed, Chris. Oh, okay, man. No. Fact check. Damn. <laughs> I'm about to go out there tomorrow. Hey, look, I remember going in there and they're like, what do you... Like, what do you need? It's like, I need a poster board and some stickers and some book. glue and uh, half a, like half of a science fair project. Like, what you mm-hmm. got? And they were yeah, like, yeah. they were like, it's in aisle six, baby. Go get what you need. You can be mm-hmm. cashing out over there. Mm-mm-mm. If you if you know, you know. That's all I'm saying. If you know, you know. That's the teacher's like, I didn't know you get that giant, like, roll of cart or of, of uh, construction yeah. paper, right? Like, yeah. mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. teacher store was the shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that, that was legit, man. That needs to be another. You no, know, we we did this episode. I want to say, sometime last year. I do need to bring it back. You know, like you know, thing from your childhood, or like you know, you're old when yeah, you know, you're old when fill in the we, blank. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we, we I do we need to bring. We that can do back. that. We can do that uh, in the next month. So, David, you missed a great story about Walter's education. My man's got the whole <laughs> setup look like the Godfather over there. The whole setup. Hey, real talk though. He that that does look kind of tight. I know. I was like, I was like, I need to make it. I need my room to look like that. I don't, I don't know if it, I don't know if any, but when he entered the room, like he turned the light on and stuff. Like like <laughs> muted brass like instruments started playing in the background. I don't know if anybody else heard Ooh. that. I am a producer, so leave the gun. Take the cannoli. That's what it just says. Leave the cannoli. Take the gun. Get out of here. Uh, what do you know? Like, that, 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 that Why not take good. both? No, nah, bro. Check, just take the cannoli. <laughs> no, I'm hungry. Leave the cannoli. Take oh, the Lord. gun. Goodness Leave. Uh, let's see. Last go for the cannoli right now. Okay. All right, y'all. Let, let's put this. Let's put this to rest. Arkansas. What is it? South. I first Southwest. of all, I, first of all, I forgot Arkansas was a state. Okay, but uh, Arkansas- how do you forget Arkansas? No, no one. Okay, <laughs> let, let me say. Wait, Chris. Chris, Chris. Can I go? Can I go? Can I go? Go ahead. That will get you. That will get you fined for that, good sir. Yeah, but we're not in Arkansas, are we? No. I know. Thank God. Arkansas. If people in Arkansas do not play this while you're in Arkansas. Okay. That's right. They will Dude, find look. you, and we do not care. <laughs> well, guess what? We will we not pay your fine. Well, guess what? You can say that same thing about the state because we don't care. The only time I care about Arkansas, we do care about Arkansas. About- Shout out to all of our listeners in Arkansas, Little Rock. What 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 are the, what are the cities? Yeah, yeah. What else? Little Rock, Fayetteville, oh, XRK, Pine Bluff. Uh, we hey, got Pine y'all, Bluff, Jonesboro. Get off of Google, Chris. I'm this man is shut up. We got. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, hold you could have Googled this all the time. I would have got all thirteen colonies. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. West Memphis. Oh, my. oh he got the oh he got the map. Okay. <laughs> he got, okay. We lost. I'm what lost. a what are the, uh what Texarkana, <laughs> Texarkana, Texas slash yep. Texarkana, Arkansas. Yo, yep. there Yo, was I a crazy know, series of murders know, there right. back in the forties. Yeah. Uh, real yeah. quick, shout out to uh to my to my friends down in Arkansas. Hello, how you doing? Welcome to the podcast. Have a good time. But uh, how do you forget our? How do you forget Arkansas is a state, man? First of all, first of all, first of all, I've it's never heard anyone. My, I've listening. never heard anyone in my life say I cannot wait to go to Arkansas. Never, I've never, never heard, heard of it. it. Never heard. I've of it. never nope. heard that in my life. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. I don't know. The only time I even, I, I'm not I lie, The only time I ever even think about it is just uh, when history class. Just I me mean, talk about the whole desegregation. That's it. The the only time that I even cared about Arkansas is when I was passing the I forty bridge right from Tennessee past in Arkansas. That was it. Damn. That was it. That was it. I, I also forgot that uh, Rhode Island was a state. Just putting that out there. Well, say. I mean, and Delaware. I forgot Delaware. I mean, well, that look, man, that state. one. Those. I mean, not not to offend anybody from Rhode Island or Delaware, but that kind of makes sense considering the fact that they are We're just significantly saying. smaller than literally ninety percent of this country. I forgot We're Idaho was ninety percent of this country. I forgot Idaho was a state for one time. No, nah, that's you forget the potato state. Wait, how do you forget where? Yeah, exactly. I mean, not all potatoes care. come from. Not all potatoes come from. Idaho. You ain't never had Orida potatoes before. Yo, if it's not if it's not an Idaho potato, I don't want. What's Idaho potato? Let me tell you that. It's, it's not an Idaho or an Irish Idaho. potato. I don't want it. Oh what gosh. is it? Good Idaho. No, Idaho no, potato. No, 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 or state. Ida. Or Ida. You know the French fries in the bag from the freezer section? Fam. Oh, them nasty things. <laughs> get the Crisco, get that get that Crisco working in there. Yeah, you know, and then, the you, you, get, and then you put it in and run away. 
<laughs> got rid of my, that, that yeah. Crisco green. I'm telling you, yo, Ooh, them time them consumers. Upset. Like, a bunch of people. That time we, we've, we've, upset, we've, upset, upset, we've upset people in eight states right there with putting stuff in Greece. Hey, 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 so y'all, 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 y'all got to understand, man. There's First been off, a lot. Of- I know you ain't talking. We offended people when they literally fry watermelon somewhere. Yeah, that, that, you're right. You're right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, hold on. I'm going to say, there have, been a lot, there, have, there have been a lot of fires. To Basil, we don't have Chris, time. There have been a lot of time, Basil. Yeah, we don't have time for that, Basil. Look it up. Look it up on your own time. Don't let it go. All right, go. all right, Nebraska. Uh, Midwest. Where is that at? It's in the plains. <laughs> it's in the Midwest. <laughs> I, Actually, I don't know if I would call Walter, it you bring Midwest. Up a good, you, no, you bring up a good point. Mid, is it Tornado where Alley? Exactly, where does Midwest Alley, where, Yeah, where, is, where does stop. it start? Where does it stop? So, I would say Nebraska is a great plain state. You know, it, it is yeah, a great plain state. Y'all, y'all, ain't gonna like, y'all ain't gonna like this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it the Midwest. You shut. Why, why? Why would you give it to me? Because people do say uh, the Dakotas are the Midwest. They do. Well, I I think it's because I, you, you know how we were just talking about how we think of all the other states as East Coast, but mm-hmm. there's actually there's <coughs> other terms for the others. Yeah, but I no feel one cares like we about do the other terms. New England, Mid Atlantic, South. No, I'm saying no one cares about those other terms. We just say, people I'm say East Coast. A lot of people just say East Coast, and people say East Coast. Right. Don't hate me. Midwest, I'm gonna say all West these places half and half. Whatever y'all want it. Half and half. half, half. Is, I, I, half I, I, Twenty-five on the east, twenty-five on the west. Break these states right. in half is part of one region and another region. I mean, there there are there have been. I mean, there are a few places where like the time zones. Cut it like halfway through the state, they're like through like Indiana, which is messed up because I think no, if, no, you, no, if you're no, in a time not. zone, I think that the time zone should go around the state border. So people in the state would be like, I agree. Yes, four o'clock. for the long oh, time, I thought it did, but clock. when I found that out, I was like, like oh, Tennessee no. is like that too. Mm-hmm. Oh, Tennessee ba- has it. Ba- ba- basically, mm-hmm. when you talk about the time, basically, when you mm-hmm. talk about Indiana and the time zones, it depends on what part you're at. Like, which is stupid. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Like, if if like the time zone, like right now, is what 10 o'clock. It is like nine o'clock over in Gary, Indiana, right now as we speak. Since it's like thirty minutes away from um from where the Illinois border is, you no know, going to Chicago, but over here in Fort Wayne, it's ten on one. So it's kind of, I think it should be the same everywhere. In my personal opinion, because that's just it, it. Just throws you off. Like if you drive to Chicago, it just just throws you off, like big time, like for real. Because in like in Indiana, from Indiana to Michigan, they say, "Hey, welcome to Michigan." It says, "Hey." We're in the Eastern Time Zone, and then the other side exactly. is Indiana. We're in the Central Time Zone, right? Like you know, if but I'm I, drawing, but then like, I forget that Indiana on your side of the state, Chris, is in the Eastern Time Zone. Exactly. On the West like, side, like, I'm like, like what if, the fuck? Right, like if I'm driving from here to say Detroit, for example, so I know it's going to be on the same Eastern Time frame, just like you mentioned before. But if you're going from say, I don't know, say Michigan City, Indiana, which is like right. Even northwest in of the um of the yeah, there's the Michigan City, Indiana. Um, then that's really really gonna mess the time frame up. So you got you got Michigan City, you got yeah. South Bend, which is about 45 minutes away and such. It's, it'll really mess you up with the time wise. So no, you no, you really want to know what really messes y'all up, Arizona. Oh god, well, Arizona. Oh yeah, they just don't do. Oh, all right. Do Can I speak at all. There? Go go yeah. go ahead, David. Our, our Arizona uh delegate. Damn. Yeah. Listen. Uh oh. As much as I had it there, because it uh-huh. made absolutely no sense to me. That time zone made no sense to me. It's like it's, a, it's, a, it's like a half it's hour. It's Mountain zone. Standard Time. What is Mountain Standard Time? Why uh, that is two, two hours, hours, two hours, two hours after two hours minus yep. Easter. Is that yeah? Like, That's it. like but, there are like, there are a few I, states in Mountain Standard Time. It's like wait, name the other two. It, it, no, there's I one, two, Colorado, three, four, Wyoming. five, six, seven, wait, eight, so nine, pretty ten. Pretty much everything that runs north of that. There's 12 it's, states wait. in Mountain Standard Time. Yeah. Isn't New Mexico one of those states? Yep. It's a, yeah. 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 My, my dad, my and dad El Paso, was. Texas. <laughs> of course. Okay. Of course <laughs> that is. Hey, deep. look, if we're, if we're, deep look, deep I'm not, I'm not so upset with that as much as I am the fact that, uh, I think it is Arizona actually doesn't have daylight savings time. They doesn't they don't. have it. They don't. At no. All. Nope. And, <laughs> and like, I, I, I get, all. like, I get it. We, we're not in a, we're not in the wartime, so we definitely shouldn't have it because the entire point of it was to increase production for the war. But like, the war, there was farming. Well, that too, but like the other fact, are you drinking Uh-oh. a Shasta? Anyways, um, the other, the other 49th, like the other, 
Bezos put his drink like, down. No. Jazz just... Bezos was like, he was like, he just... <laughs> good God, good God, Bezos, Jesus. Bezos put that drink down so quick. He don't, feels so don't embarrassed. Call, don't call Steve Austin over here. Jesus. But no, like I, I just like that threw me for a loop more than the the, the time zone change. I was like, oh, it makes sense. It's mountain, it, sure, it's mountain standard time. We'll go for it. But I was like, wait, wait, they don't have daylight savings. Daylight savings at all. So they don't like, do it at I was, all. When I crazy. moved here and my parents were still in Arizona, it was like, I don't know what time it. I mean, I know what time it is, but you're two hours behind. But when it's daylight saving time, you're three hours behind. Yeah. He was like, I mean, the I clock makes sense, the right but I'm confused, my friend. Where? Just move to Vegas. You'll be in PST. Yeah. <laughs> Which I didn't know that Vegas was in PST until I went there. I was like, oh, it's actually really? PST. I, I thought mean, it was Valentine's Day. Yeah, well, it, so. it, takes, it takes four hours to drive from Las Vegas to LA. Yeah. So but it makes sense that they're kind of, of there. Uh, and they're both, they're both relative. I mean, they're close to California is on the coast, but Nevada, it, it makes sense. Yeah, so yeah, I thought it, I thought it was, it was right in the right. mountains. So I thought, but when I hey, got to I, the airport, I was like, "Oh, it's actually I would, three hours." My, I would be kind of nervous to if I were to like fly to like Carolina, like no, not Carolina, um, California, what have you, because like the time zone is so different. They're like, you know, they're three out behind us over here. Yo, know, it's it is it, horrible, Chris. Like your jet lag is like horrible. Your, like your body's just not you. Like I'm used to like you know if we're an hour behind, if I'm in Alabama or Georgia, that's fine. But three hours behind, that's like. Your Whoa, body has to get used to it. Yeah. Yeah. And like I kind of got used to it because I gotta go to well, I do want to go to California, at least to experience it. But yeah, that would be insane. Yeah. Like I would probably be getting tired way earlier than how I normally would be. But hey man, yeah, yeah. you'll like, be tired around, you'll be tired around like, like seven or eight o'clock. Yeah, and by that time, most people they're just warming up. So right, because I had a comedy show to go to at 10 o'clock P- PST. I was at the show like Ooh, I'm, gonna go to oh, I'm, good, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I ain't going I'm to like, California after what Chris had told us. I'm I'm straight. Uh, my parents told me and what Chris told me. I'm like, yeah. Just no. come with me. Just come with me. Just come with me. Just, no. Exactly. No. It's great. Cool. Why do you You're a like troll. People. I can't trust the troll. I understand. You're good. I understand. <laughs> I, I, I understand. I understand what I did. Okay. I'm sorry. Troll? I I'm sorry, you. David. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, a troll? We go I am a troll when it comes to California. He's going to bring us to the other side, and he's going to be like, yeah, so uh, you got the money right in front of the homeless people that's right there, hey, and hey, then hey, run hey, away. Hey, so hey, so these, are, these, are the of, these are the words of David just... Alex Dorday. These are the words of David Alex Dorday, and these are not the words of Chris <laughs> Fast Quarter, uh, even, though, even though I did do that in L.A. Anyway, <laughs> next, we're going to talk about it's my top 10 if there were n- uh, new biopics for musicians, okay, these are my top ten. I want to hear this. Now we have some great biopics already. We got Ray, we yep. got Tina Turner's "What's Love Got to Do with It." Yep, go ahead. We got. We even got the 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 uh, the Jackson story. Anyway, we have. <laughs> we're hey. gonna talk about my top ten. Next music biopic movies. Now, number 10. There's no honorable mentions because I just made this list two seconds ago. Now, <laughs> number 10. We done been through your list already, man. That's just number 10. Ready bon to Jovi. Yeah, what would you call it? Oh, I I have, t- I have titles too. Bon Jovi oh, is because titles. okay. I'm gonna be generic with this one. It's gonna be called Living on a Prayer. Why not? It's my life. I like that. It's my life. That's a good one, too. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Or runaway. Living on a Prayer is literally probably like their. It's my life came out in like two thousand, like two thousand. No, it's my life. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Like well, I guess Living on a Prayer that was their first. That was their first album. The that's like their, wet. probably like their most well known song. So yeah, I, I, I was, I would, I would say Living on a Prayer. Yeah, okay, yeah right, there. Basil, right, Basil, our resident white guy. <laughs> Good God. Chris is trying to get canceled again. I, I, I feel like it's, this, it's this not 30, 30, 30, 30, time Chris trying to get it's canceled. It's not living on the prayer. It's going to be like dead or alive. Him. Welcome back to the Chris Cross. Dead or alive. That was a good one, too. That was a good oh, one. Yeah. That, that's my personal favorite by them. It is? That's crazy. But to me, to me personally. Which I actually, one was, I, I, which one was it? I, 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 say, I say it because I actually did meet Bon Jovi once. I just, um, that's why I say that. Wait, which Weird one? Story. Dead or alive. Okay. Yeah. Oh, actually, yeah, that one works too. Hmm. Yeah. 
I'm, I'm, I'm Chris, if you're trying to get an honorary white card, too. so you can be invited to the cocktail party. No, I'm not. The cocktail. I'm, shoot, I don't want to go to the cocktail party. Not you, party. Bird. Oh, Chris. Yeah, Chris Bird. Yeah, he, he wants to get Woo! in. He, he is, gets the invite to the cocktail party. What is the, the cocktail, cocktail party? party? Is that it's the, like white the cookout? But That's different. the white cookout, man. It's the oh, cookout, okay. but different. Okay, no, no, no. Um, He's invited to the I, picnic. <laughs> now, historians, <laughs> if you know what picnic comes from, you'll uh, 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 Let's see. Okay. I know that. <laughs> David knows. Oh, shit. The All right. White teachers made sure okay. I knew that. <laughs> All right. Number nine from my top 10 next biopic movies. Janet Jackson. Why yeah. does she need a biopic? Because she needs she, one. She needs For one. What? She just had one. She just had one of her documentaries on on Lifetime. What, and why? She, and and she kind great. of done. done it if it doesn't Lifetime. include the nipple, why? No, no ho, uh, actually, hold on. That could that could be. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> what would you call? It? What would you call the biopic then? Wardrobe. It's, it's, it's gonna be. It's gonna be called Janet. That's what's gonna be called. Yeah, that that that's perfect. It's that's successful. as worse as Kanye's genius. What? So that's perfect. A Janet Jackson story perfect. named Janet. It's simple. Hey, she had an album like that too in the nineties. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think I think it's, and it's it sold point. billions of copies. With with the it's, with it, the Jackson being point. how they are, that that works perfectly. Mm-hmm. And, and it's to the point. Could everybody know Michael? Nobody don't want to yeah. see a Tito documentary. Don't nobody <clears throat> want to see that. Actually, a Tito sure. documentary would be great. It'll be great. You on don't want to see Central. a Jermaine documentary. Jermaine will only have like two minutes of a documentary. No, Jermaine would be a great. The Jermaine would be a great documentary. Thank you, Walter. I love Wait, it. Janet, Janet, I think I think that's perfect. Jermaine, Jermaine was solo before Michael did. I'm just saying, just putting that out there. Ooh, ooh, how about Latoya? Remember? Or a Latoya? No, <laughs> no, let's not bring up Latoya. There. No, no. All right. Anyway, speaking of, uh, let's not let's not talk about Latoya Jackson right now. La, um, La, La, Latoya gets um she she gets celebrated on February fifteenth for the side chicks. So, all right. Uh, anyway, <laughs> number eight for my next biopic movie, <laughs> Parliament Funkadelic. Yes, that'd be really good. One Nation Under a Groove. I like it. Yes. I like it. That's a good one. I like it. I like it. But it I has like to be similar to a bit. But like they kind of. They kind of did something similar with the Funk Brothers because they did their documentary in like the early two thousands. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I, I, I like it though. I, I, like but it. I see what you're doing. I, I, I'm, I'm for it. Hey, now, for I, have it? A, I have a question for you then. Who would be George Clinton? You know, oh my god! Why would he be on a stage dancing in a diaper? And Anderson hey. Pack. <laughs> Anderson Pack would be George Clinton, a young George Clinton. Low key. Yeah, you that know what? I, I, I like that. I like that. That can work. Low key. Who's playing Bootsy? Who? No, you don't. Don't bring up Bootsy. Oh shit! Hey, hey you gotta bring up Bootsy College, man. Come on. Uh, I, mean, I, mean, I mean, he he was part of Parliament Funk. Adult. It's just uh, Bootsy. Just Bootsy. Bo- Bootsy like, plays Bootsy. Boots. Oh, you can't have nobody else play Bootsy. I mean, you right. You right. You yeah. right. Yeah. <laughs> Bootsy's gonna play Bootsy. Oh lord. Uh, number seven. Speaking of George Clinton, uh, uh number seven is the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Hmm. Boy, yeah, Bird, really. how would you want it to that, be? That that would be that would be a really good documentary. They've gone through how they met, how they met George Clinton, and they had to record their first album in Detroit with George. Clinton. I feel like I feel I, I don't want it to be, but I feel like that if they did a biopic about it, they would probably call it. And this is I don't want it, but they they probably end up calling it Californication. Yes, I call it Californication. I, I was I was I was gonna say that. My hey, uh, but yeah. I, I think. Song wise, they they could probably go with a different name, but that's that that would bring it in automatically. Mm-hmm. Under yeah, the bridge, under, under the bridge. I thought about that too, but yeah, no one would buy it. Feel like feel like the <laughs> then you just were like, yeah, these guys were like hobos who formed a band and mm-hmm. got famous, and that's hobos not exactly what happened. Band. They were they were just hanging out on Sunset Boulevard, like, hey man, want to join my group? Yeah, man. Yeah. Oh wait. Sure, man. oh wait, that was Motley Crue. No wait, that was Guns N' Roses. No wait, okay. that was the okay. Go-Go's. <laughs> okay. No wait. Real, real talk, real, the Motley Crue biopic on, on Netflix is super good. Like, it's it good. Is, but the beginning part was kind of like, it was extra. You didn't have to do all that. It really didn't, but still, it was good. But it was oh, good. Wait. It was good. I, I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. So mm-hmm. Netflix, if you're listening to this, and if y'all do it, just uh, send some royalties over to, uh, to Chris Carcon's way, please. Oh, oh, I got it. I got it. Um, who would play Bootsy in uh in One Nation Under a Groove biopic? You remember the uh, the guy who played um 
uh, MC Ren and uh, Straight Outta Compton. Okay. I my think man from uh, my man, what's his, uh, from Entourage? man from Leverage, yeah. Oh, Leverage, 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 Leverage. Le- I'm leverage. Sorry, Entourage. I know, I can see that. I can see that. Yeah. I haven't seen Leverage in a minute. I can see it a little bit. They brought it back. They did. What channel? It's Ion oh. Plus. Ion Plus. Okay, we good. We out here. No, oh, I thought you were gonna say uh, Clifton Powell to be Bootsy. Oh hell no! <laughs> sing it, sing the note. <laughs> Aldous Hodge, is that who you're thinking of? Yep, exactly. Yeah. So just looking at uh, looking that guy up, I just found out what one of his middle names was. What? Basil. Oh, that's cute. The name comes in all shapes and colors, man. <laughs> uh-huh. Based off of food. Bez was like, yeah, I'm about to listen to this guy now. <laughs> Too fast. <laughs> all right, number five. Rage Against the Machine. Yeah. Dude, if you guys, really, if you guys, well, really, if you guys really want to know the origin that, that, of Rage Against the voice. Machine, that would be probably be one of the best biopics if they do it right. It would be. It would be. Oh yeah. I think, but I think to bring in the most people, they would have to just call it Rage Against, Rage Against the Machine. Yeah, or Killing in the Name of. Killing in the Name of Bulls on Parade, um, one something like that. But yeah, they got uh, testify. They, they, yeah. No shelter. I'm playing. No, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Ooh. Uh, that was that was good. Number four. I don't one. know if this has been done before, but Whitney Houston. People have done it. We, I do, I do have not. They? I do have not. They? Acknowledge... Didn't Lifetime like... try? Let's ask try. our good friend Google. Let's let, fact check. Oh, wait, wait, Did I, they I do got, a I Whitney got, Houston I, biopic? I got it. I got it. Google, if you're listening, please sponsor us. I wish I could sponsor you. Oh, yeah. Okay. I want to dance with somebody. It's coming out apparently this year. Oh. Oh, there, there, there I want to dance is. with somebody. Hmm. Huh. I mean, they put Stanley Tucci in this movie. Oh, what? Oh, he also okay. had a movie called, or she also had a movie called Whitney back in 2015. Yeah, but this is a lifetime, though. Who His is lifetime. that? It, it, also, it was it, overly it, dramatic. It, yeah. yeah. It was like Bobby Brown, don't give me the booger sugar. Who is Stanley? Stanley Tucci? Uh, he's, he's, uh, he's in a lot of stuff. I'm trying to think of what it was in recently. Let's see. Probably nothing. Yeah, if it's if it's a lifetime, <laughs> if, it, if, if it's a li- if it's on lifetime, then I'm sorry, that already brings my oh, interest God. down because it's lifetime. Because it's oh, I don't, I, that that's some you you don't you don't put that on like on TV. You you put it in the big screen, man. Like get get give me the read the treatment. You know, put it in the big screen. No, I'm just saying. Number number three uh, is going to be Rush. And Not me a twist, eh? Fly by Night. Mm, I, I like don't it. hate that. <laughs> Watch is like trying to go through the song list. Oh. Hey, <laughs> like, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm looking up Stanley Tucci. Hold up. <laughs> oh, oh uh, well, no. I was I was still looking. I was still looking up that. Uh, Whitney Houston movie that's coming oh. out and it's written by the same guy that did Bohemian Rhapsody. So it could be good. It could be good. I, I might watch it. I might watch it. But it's on Lifetime. That, that, I'm not. No, 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 no. no, no. That's, no this, this is something not different. on Lifetime. This one is. No, this is a different one. That's an actual thing. Yeah, this one. This one got made by TriStar. Oh, Columbia. Mm-hmm. Columbia. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. So I'm like, oh, oh this that, could be watch good. It. I'm they, not they watching. Pull, they pulled me back. They pulled yeah. me back. <laughs> I, I'll I'll do it because I'm supporting I'm supporting the people. So I'll. Uh, I'll give it to him. All right, my top my top two are gonna be kind of biased because we're in Detroit. So yeah. number two is gonna be Diana Ross. Yeah. Why does she need one? Look, I like it's freaking right. Diana Ross. I like That's Diana cool. Ross. So please do not feed her ego anymore. I know. I need. Wait, didn't you? I, I, I need a, a. I need a reasonable explanation. As to why she needs one. All right, Diana, Diana Ross, if you're going to do the, of the, her Wiz alone. 2, the Wiz 2 of is coming out in 2023. I'm about to say, the Wiz 2. <laughs> oh, my God. What happened to the Scarecrow, Dorothy? Plastic surgery and drugs. Um, wait, 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 oh. What? <laughs> Plastic surgery and drugs. I love, how we traded, I love how we traded swearing. 
but now we've just gone straight up controversial. <laughs> I mean, I don't well, think we're gonna be. Are we really Trey swearing? Because now Chris got to do a whole bunch of bleeps on himself. I know. I, know. <laughs> I was about. To, I was gonna point that out. We're not. I'm not like, gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna edit it out at all. I'm not gonna edit. I'm gonna say, "Calm down, people," and then sat there and like I was I'm like, okay, drop it was a hypocrite." F bombs. I can't. A, a I'm whole bunch somebody's of here in this, I guess. He's got a whole bunch of issues. I'm just saying. Hey, <laughs> All right, number one. Hey, Speed of issues. Walter, I guess we're gonna be on. We're gonna be with Houston. All right, number one for my top ten of music. Bad, big so we can laugh. It's gonna be the one, the okay. only. Okay. Stevie Wonder. Songs in the key of life. No, nah, it's, it's no. It's it's gonna be called Stevie Wonder. That's it. Why? Stevie how about because the wonder name, the, the name the name says it all. The name says it all. You how about you have a title. The name says it all. Wonder, okay. Wonder, I can no. see. But nah, Stevie Wonder, Stevie, Stevie Wonder. No, no, I got. Oh, no, I Walter, gotta give it. Walter, if you say Stevie Wonder, yeah, I go to the movies. As soon as the credits roll up, I'm already in line to get the ticket to see it again. Exactly. First off, exactly. Hey, um, real talk. There's he have you guys two biopics. Uh, I'm have an act two. Oh shit! If you uh, if you really think about it, he may need two of them. <laughs> so you can do you know. So his, so so what, before okay, and okay. after he was blind. Like come on, man. What okay, are you doing? so so. What you mean before and after he was blind? He, no, I, no, I, no. I, I, that was so, only a short period of time when he wasn't blind. So, <laughs> I, I I'm 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 flustered because oh, God. I don't know. Because usually all these people beforehand can actually see their own biopic. I don't know, Chris. If Stevie, can Chris, see his own Chris can't see. I think he died right before it came he out. He died right before it came yeah. out. He died right before it came out. Um, well, he he might before. be able to see it. Is the question? I mean, he might be able to see from heaven. I don't know. Ray might. No, be he able couldn't to. see it. No, he he's making a blind it. joke. <laughs> I'm making oh, a blind that's joke. Exactly what he was doing. I, I caught that. <laughs> Wait. Uh. Hey. Can I? Can I throw two your way? Go ahead, go ahead. What you got? Uh, ahead. the stones, the stones. Give it the like, stones. Call, it like, call it, give me shelter or something stupid. I don't know. Hey, hey, Walter, let me check out a movie. Walter, sure. They already did one. They, they did? did one. Yes. Wait, 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 where's Fire. where's the stones biopic at? Boss by a hurricane. HBO did I think three years ago. Okay. Um. Wait. wait, wait was was it a biopic or like an HBO documentary? Because those are drastically. Those different are two things. different things. Two different things. Okay, and I'm not a movie of, person, but I okay, know it's two different okay, things. Okay, I think it was more. Okay, my second, my second one. Uh, have you guys seen a movie or a, a nope. show called After Party? It nope. sounds it's, familiar. It's like really new. It came out like earlier this year. No. Nope. Um. So real quick, it's got Tiffany Haddish in it. It's hilarious. Uh, for all for all the wildest reasons, but in there, um. One of the characters, because it's, it's like a murder, it's like a comedy murder investigation. It's really weird. But um one of the one of the one of the characters in there did a biopic, a fictional biopic for Hall and Oates. And I and now people are actually trying to make it because it has Dave Franco and Channing Tatum. Um I would watch that. I would, I would watch, watch Hall that Hall several Oates. times. Well, same right. thing with Stevie, right? Like I I'd watch, I'd be with you back in line to catch it again. I'd be in line to catch a, a Hall and Oates documentary again. <laughs> Um uh, or a biopic again. Um, Chris, don't lie. You know you're gonna be up in there to see Hall of Oats. Don't even lie. I I will. <laughs> no, Chris, 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 if you say that right now, if they do sing three and they have all Hall of Oats songs, you know you're gonna be in line to watch it again. Stop, Stop. it. Okay, okay. Low king. Low king. Sing two was trash. I'm just gonna put that out. Here. Okay, okay, okay. I'll no, like, sing I, sing two I'll is better than sing two. one. Oh hell no! no, don't, no don't, don't say that. Don't yeah. say that. Speaking don't, to don't it being kind of trash. Don't, don't, say, don't, don't say that. Don't say don't that. that. Anywho, don't say that. Don't say Anywho, that. are y'all gonna watch Kanye West's? Yes. Do we? Do we? Yeah. We, wait, we're watching I, it right now. We're living I, it right now. Hey, hey, it's like I was You mean Kanye West's biopic called Donda? Yeah, I'm, hey, I'm, I'm not watching. No, 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 it's called Genius. No, I'm not. I'm not I mean, watching. David, let me say this. Before we got on here, I was listening to 808s and Heartbreak before before I even joined it. I'm not going to. That was your first mistake. First That's off, what took him so that he had to finish first, the album before you logged on. First off, why 808s? No, why why 808s? I would have been fine how you would have said late registration, college. Wait, hold up, you don't like 808 and Heartbreak? 
It, it, out of his first five albums, it's the weakest one. I'll hey, agree I mean, to that, that, but it's still a good damn, album. Damn, only like three songs. Yeah, it's still album. good. There's it's only three it's, songs it's, on the album. Only I mean, like three songs on the album. Hey, okay, hey, 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 hey. I don't know if y'all seen it, but Kanye's kind of going after everybody right now. So maybe we shouldn't pick on Kanye West. Kanye, come wanna, at me, bro. Wanna... Let's go. Hey, so... no, no, stop, stop this. You are too I'm militant. Be famous. Stop this. <laughs> I'm the only one what? in here that actually I'm likes Kanye. I'm when it's hot. <laughs> as soon as he come at me for being a weak producer, I'm dropping. Hey, look, please. Look, all, I, all, I, all I'm saying is, <laughs> all I'm saying West. is, if I wake up to, if I wake up, <clears throat> if I wake up tomorrow, and I see that Kanye posted I'm on Twitter right now. If, hey. if, if I wake up tomorrow and see that Kanye posted another Civil War photo of like him and his guys on one side and the five of us on the other, I'm coming after all four of y'all. That's fine. Hey, I you like Kanye. Me, me out of but guess what, though? As soon as I cut you a couple of the million, you ain't going to be coming after me no more. All right. Dave, 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 hold on. Wait. Let me say, I'll listen, I'll listen to 808. I'll listen to 808's a heartbreak. One, because I'll listen to Heartless. That's one. And earlier today, so I did listen to the entirety of My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, which is still, in my opinion, his best album. Um, real you quick, know? um, am I the only one that just found out? And, I mean, you can call me stupid if you want. No. But I, I just found out that uh, Alicia Keys is married to Swiss Beats. All right, y'all. That's, oh been, a, that's been another edition of the Chris Cross hey! Please subscribe to YouTube. Please, please, please subscribe to the podcast or Apple Podcasts, Spotify, YouTube, Instagram. Anywhere you get your TikTok. podcast. Anywhere you get your podcast, anywhere you listen, get on anywhere you get your social media, social media. Walter, you're messing up. I'm stuttering because of you. Thanks a lot. Walter, even I know it's okay, that. Okay, I'm here. Even even the <laughs> resident white boy knows that Swiss Beast is married to Alicia Keys. That's hey, because I, that white boy loves black women. Yes, he does. And thank you guys. <laughs> Yo. Stay safe and be nice to each other. Y'all are the worst. <laughs>